how do you teach multiplication? It's a very important operation. I'm Jimmy, and we're here to discuss how to teach multiplication. It's a very important operation, perhaps more so than addition and subtraction, but once you understand those two, multiplication is the next logical step. So let's get into just a couple of examples to give you an idea as to how multiplication works. Suppose you want to find out what 3 times 4 is. That means you take the number 3 and you add it to itself 4 times. So in other words, you have 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3. Well, where you, do, where you go from there is basically start adding until you get to what you need. So for example, 3 plus 3 is going to be 6 plus 3 plus 3 is going to be 6, and 6 plus 6 is going to give you 12. Another quick example would be if you have 3 times 1. Seems simple, but still important to uh, get that out. That basically, you take the 3 and you add it just once. In other words, just 3. You only see the 3 once. So therefore, 3, well, is just 3. But what about 0? How would you teach multiplying by 0? Let's just say you have 7 times 0. Well, a nice way to do it would be if you were to draw 7 blanks and blank has nothing. So you have 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0 plus 0, and I think you know what the answer might be, 0. So I'm Jimmy, and here are some tips on how to teach multiplication.